Hello, and again, it's story time with Miss Reed. Um, here I've got a classic fairy tale, The Three Little Pigs. The Three Little Pigs. This version is written by Xavier Peralta and illustrated by Olivia Beckham. Three little pigs built themselves three little homes. The first pig built a house with straw. The second pig built a house with sticks. The third pig built a house with bricks. No sooner had the first pig moved into his house than the wolf came by. He was very hungry and he could think of nothing more tasty than a young, juicy pig. Little pig, little pig, let me in, the first pig replied. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, roared the wolf. So he huffed and he puffed and he blew the straw house down. The little pig ran away to his sister's house made of sticks. Soon the wolf was at the door of that house too. Little pigs, little pigs, let me in. The second pig squealed. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, howled the wolf. So he huffed and he puffed and he blew the wooden house down. The little pigs ran away to their brother's house made of bricks. The wolf soon found that house too. He called, little pigs, little pigs, let me in. The third pig replied, not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, shouted the wolf. And he huffed. And he puffed until he nearly burst. But he could not blow the brick house down. Perhaps he'll go away, said the first pig. No, squealed the second pig. I can see him climbing up the drain pipe. He'll try coming down the chimney, gasped the third pig. The pigs cooked a pot of soup in the fireplace. They removed the lid and stoked up the fire. You can see he's putting in some more logs there. The wolf sniggered. I'm coming to eat you up, little pigs. One of you for breakfast, one for lunch, and one for dinner. But he jumped right down the chimney, straight into the pot. Ow! cried the wolf. He hopped around the house, howling in pain. The third pig threw open the window and the wolf leapt out. The three little pigs knew he would never bother them again. Oh, look at them treating themselves to a nice tea. Probably going to not eat that soup, though. Not a great idea. Very nice. What a lovely story. Classic.